Is YouTube right for you? I'm gonna tell you why you should not do YouTube and we're starting right now. What is going on? My name is Nick, welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you wanna learn how to grow your channel, make videos and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. And real quick, what are some reasons you think people shouldn't do YouTube? I would love to know what you think. Let me know in the comments below. Okay, first, it's important that I mention that I'm not trying to discourage you in any way, that I'm not trying to suck the wind out of your sails, so to speak, or anything like that, but there are some reasons that you should not be doing YouTube. Here they are. Number one, if you consistently dread making videos and you consistently just don't want to do it, it's okay to walk away. I'm not gonna judge you, nobody else is gonna judge you. It's important that you're happy, life is short. Number two, if you're constantly spreading or constantly getting caught up in negativity around YouTube or you're making videos spreading negativity, I mean, if you're being a drag just for the sake of being a drag because you think it's gonna bring you views, you should probably hang it up. Number three, if YouTube is taking over your life. You know, I mean, we were just talking about life being short, right? Look, like every other serious creator out there, you know, I've had to make, you know, my share of sacrifices. I've had to, you know, reschedule things. I mean, Saturday night is my live streaming night. That's a sacrifice. But you know, like anything in life, there's certain things that you need to do in order to accomplish what it is that you want to accomplish and all of that good stuff. But what I'm saying is if it's impeding on your life to the point that you're just overwhelmed and you're like, oh my gosh, I don't even know what's going on. Maybe you should take a break, you know, shake it off a little bit, get a little refresher, give yourself, you know, a little bit of time off and then come back a little bit stronger. Number four, if you don't know why you're doing YouTube in the first place. And I'm talking really deep down, know why it is that you're making videos. Like if you don't know what you're trying to do, you know, are you trying to be famous? That's totally fine. Are you trying to make money? That's totally fine. If you're trying to help others, you're trying to spread a message, you're trying to put some joy out there into the world, that's also totally fine. Whatever the reason, if you have a reason, it's totally cool. But if you don't know why you're making videos in the first place and you're just throwing up a bunch of stuff, then maybe you should reevaluate. I am not saying to quit. What I'm saying is just reevaluate. Think about what it is that you're doing. Think about, hey, what is it that I'm actually trying to do here? And then once you get that together, you can come back a lot stronger because you'll be driven by a mission, by a purpose, by a cause. Nobody wants to get in the way of somebody that's on a mission. So when you have that reason, when you have that mission, you have that thing that you're trying to do, then most likely you'll probably get much better results. But listen, YouTube is a very powerful tool. If you use it right, it can change your life. The doors that can open for you because of the content that you create and just for you having that stage for creative expression, I mean, it's incredible. I don't know another platform on the internet that, that has what YouTube has. And the best part about it, regardless of any drama that happens on the platform, it's getting bigger. And look, if you're struggling or you're having a hard time or you're going through that learning curve part of YouTube, that's normal. It doesn't mean you should quit. It just means that you have more that you should learn. There's plenty of free information on my channel and other channels that are like mine that will help you through that process. So if you don't qualify in terms of the other reasons that I mentioned that you should probably not do YouTube, then hang in there. Just keep on trying, keep plugging away, keep going for it because it really can make a huge difference in everything it is that you do. And if you are having those issues with growth and things like that, I actually have a video about three reasons that you might not be getting subscribers. I'll put a link to it right up here. Make sure that you go check out that video because if you are having those difficulties in terms of growth, then there are some things that you might be overlooking that that video might help you with. And if you wanna learn more about growing your channel, making videos and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by hitting the round subscribe icon so you don't miss anything. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.